Hello, hello, I'm Pam and I heart saving money and I'm in desperate need of some produce. Last week I did get a few random things from Cub, milk, water, bread, some things like that, and a few items from Costco, but mainly what I focused on was stocking up on household supplies from Target. But I am running desperately low, like I said, on produce. So today is a good day to stop over at Fresh Time because it's double ad day. Meaning the sales run Wednesday to Wednesday. So one flyer is expiring today and the other one's starting. So you can use both of them. So here's what we found for some deals. Pears and peaches are 99 cents a pound. Picked up some of those. Also, grapes are 99 cents a pound. Blueberries are $1.99 for this paint. I'll include the price for the bananas because I don't remember that right off hand. $1.99 again on the cantaloupe and watermelon. Tried to look for the biggest size on both of those to get the most bang for my buck. This was a little bit more expensive than what I would like to pay for the peppers. It was $3.99 for a pound, but I know that they will be enjoyed relatively quickly, so I went ahead and got that. However, the carrots were only a dollar. Fifty cents for the cucumber. Dollar ninety-nine again on the pint of organic tomatoes, grape tomatoes. Let's see. And the mandarin oranges, they were two ninety nine for a three pound bag. So some good deals on produce. I also picked up water. Water was a little bit more than what I like to pay for it there, but it was two fifty, but I'm almost out, so I kinda needed it. Don't think I'm gonna be getting over to cup until Friday, but here's how my shopping haul is going so far this week. Off to a good start. That'll break down to just 30 cents a container, which is a, a good price in my opinion. And I was looking at the uh, ben and Jerry's here, and I remembered I had printed some coupons from coupons.com. It says it's good on the pint sizes or the slices, and I'm not sure if it'll be good on this particular kind, but I'm going to find out. And then I also printed these coupons for $2 off for slices. So I'm wondering if I could get some ice cream slices as they're called. We've not tried it before, but for 88 cents a container, that would be a good price. Or even a dollar eighty-eight for a pint. Seems like pints of ice cream are getting to be super expensive. Skipped ahead to the 10 for 10. And you normally you don't have to buy 10 to get the savings, but I'll double check that before I do this. But I'm looking at the pretzels, dollar a bag, that's a good deal. High V brand cream cheese. See carrots on the top, canned fruit, puffs. I still need to buy Queenix for the classroom. Oats, oatmeal, that's always good, and pasta. I need some whole grain pasta. I haven't found that for a while. Wonder if that's on in on the sale. Hello. So the rest of my grocery shopping, I did do a little bit last night at Cub. Just ran in for some flavored waters that my husband likes and let's see what else did we get. We got some of those naked juices. Those are on sale for two dollars a piece. And I wanted to show you, I was really excited about the Thursday deal this week, the 50 cent deal. It's the Quaker granola bars and it works on the chocolate covered as well as the, um, the dark chocolate chunk and many other flavors too. I didn't pick up their Friday freebie yet, but it's a candy item, Airheads gum. I'm not sure if I'm gonna be getting that or not, but if not, that's fine too. But I did wanna stop over at Hy-Vee to pick up some of their deals. So my daughter and I went this morning and I'll share the prices for what I remember and, uh, and close the rest below. But I wanted to make sure I got some of this whole grain pasta. I was excited to see that that was included in the 10 for 10. So a dollar each on those. The pretzels were also a dollar each on the 10 for 10. The high V brand salsa is buy one, get one free, a dollar 79 for the for one. So a dollar 79 for the two. Their brand of the pasta sauce is also a dollar. And the oats, the Quaker, er, not the Quaker, but the quick oats and the old fashioned are a dollar a piece. Good find on that. We were totally out of that. 
that's one thing where I contemplated getting more or not, but I wanted to try to stay close to $40. So I think I did pretty well because I just went a little bit over that. And another item that was on sale with my coupons is the Ben & Jerry products. The little three packs were $2.88 minus I had $2 in coupons at two of those. So $0.88 cents a piece on that. And I had $2 off for this brand that those coupons worked. So $1.88 on the ice cream. And then my meatballs were on sale. I'm not sure the price of these, but these were a BOGO. The hamburger was on sale, just over $5 for three pounds. Chicken is $0.49 cents a pound for the 10 pound bag. It was $4.90, good deal on that. Another dollar item was the sausages. I picked up three of those. And yogurts are on sale, 10 for $4. I had 50 cent coupons, 50 cents off five, so we just picked up 25 of those. Found some new flavors too that we hadn't seen at other stores, such as this one. So those are only 30 cents a piece. And the biscuits, they were for for a dollar with their in-store coupon. Another dollar item was their bread. So I picked up two loaves, one to leave out and one to put in the freezer. So I'm gonna break down my chicken and hamburger and get these deals put away. Hope you're finding some deals this week too. Let me know what your favorite deal was you found in your area. Be back again soon. Please subscribe if you enjoy money-saving hauls.